Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Stop Loss HQ Gaming. We're going to pick up right where we left off at. Same as what we always do. Diplomatic immunity, that's what's going to be next. It seems like things are worse than ever. Uh, even Delphine Dot, Delphine, whoever. The dragons aren't just coming back to life, they're being resurrected by other dragons. Delphine suspects that Thalmor might be bringing dragons back for some sinister purpose. Blah, blah, blah. So that's what's going on basically. We gotta infiltrate the Thalmor Embassy. We gotta meet Delphine in Riverwood. Uh, I might, may have probably mispronounced that name, but oh well. So this is Lydia right here. She's my companion. Lydia, let's roll, baby. Let's roll. Let's find our way out of here. Under something over here. Dang it, bro, I'm lost. Oh, whoa, whoa, no, it's not up there. Maybe I go back through here. Aha! There we go. Woo! Man, that looks cold. That looks real cold. My goodness. So, just a quick refresher. Riverwood. We gotta go to Riverwood. We're gonna fast travel there. Uh, Elgin? Riverwood. Fast travel. We are level six. So we're supposed to meet Delphine. Man, the dead bodies are still there, bro. Goodness gracious. Sleeping Giant Inn. I don't think you were following. This is a local Come favorite on. and I have a plan. one of the first songs I ever learned. Ragnar wow. the Red. Delphine ain't wasting no time. Oh, there once was a hero named Ragnar the Red who came riding to Whiterun from old Rorikstead. Wait, didn't we do this mission already? Yeah, we, we did. He uh, told of both battles in gold I he had made. I figured out how we're going to get you into the Thalmor Embassy. When he met the shield maiden Matilda, who said... That would be a bad idea. I'd be too likely to attract the wrong kind of attention. But they don't know you at all yet. So what's your plan? How do I infiltrate the Thalmor Embassy? The Thalmor Ambassador, Elenwen regularly throws parties where the rich and connected cozy up to the Thalmor. I can get you into one of those parties. Once you're inside the embassy, you can get away and find Elenwen's secret files. I have a contact inside the embassy. He's not up for this kind of high-risk mission, but he can help you. His name is Malborn. Wood Elf. Plenty of reason to hate the Thalmor. You can trust him. I'll get word for him to meet you in solitude at the Winking Skeever. You know it? While you're doing that, I'll work on getting you an invitation to Ellen Wynn's little party. Meet me at the Solitude Stables after you've arranged things with Melbourne. Any questions? Who's this contact of yours? You sure I can trust him? Don't worry about Melbourne. He's not a dangerous character like you. This is a but he hates the Thalmor at least as much as I do. He's a wood elf. The Thalmor wiped out his family back in Valenwood during one of their purges that we never hear about. Luckily, they don't know who he really is, or he wouldn't be serving drinks at the ambassador's parties. Once I'm inside the embassy, then what? That's when the fun starts. You'll have to slip away from the party without raising the alarm. Then you'll need to find Ellen Wynn's office and search her files. Melbourne should be able to point you in the right direction. Now I think it's high time that you lie down and bleed. All right, how am I going to get to this party? Let me handle that. You'll have a real invitation, don't worry. As long as you can act the part of a Thalmor toady, you'll get past the guards. All right, I'll see you in solitude after I meet my boy. Sounds good. Be careful. We drink to our youth, to Let's go, Lydia. Age of aggression is just about done. You know, it just actually kind of dawned on to me. 
Lydia reminds me of that that character from The Mandalorian, the one who's held the Mando. <laughs> I mean, come on, man. Alright, so... We gotta go to Solitude. Oh gosh, it's not been discovered yet. I can fast travel some more though. Alright, let's let's go. Oh. What's the y'all going to do about it? How are we supposed to feel safe in our own homes? Please. I actually wonder what ray tracing would look like in Skyrim. It's probably a mod for it or something like that. But I mean, if you look at how nice the water is, I mean, look at this. This is beautiful. This is on Ultra Graphics, by the if way. If you need any alchemy supplies, I'll do my best to provide them. Assuming I haven't. Ultra Graphics, and um, I'm also playing on PC. If you guys ever want to know what my specs are or anything like that, you know, just let me know in the comments. Alright, Lydia, the last time that we did this, the last time that we went across the river, you decided that it was too much. Damn, there gotta be a way around this. Mushrooms? I'll swap fungal pod. I'm trying to get across to where I don't lose Lydia. I don't want to lose her again like I did last time. Uh oh. Those spiders! Oh, these are frost ones too. We get the frostbite venom off of them. Lydia, let's go. Let's roll, baby. You definitely gotta be careful in some places of the Skyrim map because there are some creatures, man, that will just ravish the heck out of you. Lydia, we're going to have to cross the river, and I'm probably going to lose contact with you. Let's see, what happens if I go through here? Yeah, are you coming? Good, good. Okay, I'm not going to lose you. I'm going to go through here. Awesome, awesome. She's coming, all right. <laughs> so... We gotta go meet Malborn in Solitude. I guess he's gonna hook us up on how to get into the party and whatnot. Let me do a quick save just in case anything happens right around the corner. Probably just lost my companion just now, but it's okay. Um, how am I gonna get up there? Well, well, 
oh well, we're gonna have to come down here and cross. <laughs> yeah. All right. Wow, hey, it's a camp over here. Cooking spit. Pretty nice boats. Pretty nice. Looks like we're definitely gonna have to cross the river over here. Look at that. They looking like a Pokemon. Lydia, I'm going to have to swim across. Is she coming or is she drowning? <laughs> oh, okay. Pokemon, go! Mud crab, I choose you! Cross. And I'm looking for Lydia, looking for my companion. There's a slaughter fish out here. Definitely sounds like a Pokemon. I bet it's going after Lydia. I bet that's what, what's going on. I'm not going back in the water to find out, though. Lydia's going to have to just catch up when she can. Okay, so here's the road that goes. Okay, I gotta go up this way. That's like a taxi rat buggy, like he'll take you places pretty much anywhere you wanna go. Okay, hopefully we make it through here. If you've come to Solitude to join the Legion, speak to Ricker. If not, keep your nose clean when you see him. We're not gonna join no Legion as of right now. They can't hurt Uncle Rogvir. Tell them he didn't do it. There she is. Positions. Far you need to go home. Go home and stay there until your mother comes. Traitor! Get on with it! You betrayed us! Oh, you wow. should tell her that her uncle is scum that betrayed his high king. 
best she know now, Advar. They're all hard. Rogvir, you helped Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city after he murdered High King Tori. By opening that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed the people of Solitude. He doesn't deserve to speak! There was no murder. Is this a live execution? Story. He beat the High King in fair combat. You Such is be our kidding. way. Such is the ancient custom of Skyrim and all Nords. Boo! No, 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 don't, oh my god. Is this a live execution in Skyrim? Oh my god. Stay. <laughs> I go to Sovereign God. Don't do it, man. Oh! Oh my god. Mmm, <laughs> spiced wine for you? It's a family recipe. Heck yeah, I'm gonna need some after this. <laughs> oh my lord. Some gate guard you were. A live execution in Skyrim. L Lydia, can you believe that? Oh man. Good I to bad rubbish, I say. Okay, let's go. I, oh my god. I was expecting to see that. <laughs> I didn't know they they would show something like that in Skyrim. Like I just really didn't know. It's amazing. All right, who we gotta go talk to? Hmm. Need something? Our mutual friend sent me. Really? You're who she picked? I hope she knows what she's doing. Here's the deal. I can smuggle some equipment into the embassy for you. Don't plan on bringing anything else in with you. The Thalmor takes security very seriously. Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the embassy. The rest is up to you. What kind of things should I bring? You're asking me? She promised that she was sending someone who knew what they were doing. If you actually want to get out alive, I'd bring whatever you need to move quietly and kill quickly. Uh, all right, look, I'm ready. Here's what I'm doing. Okay, I'll get this inside the embassy for you. I've got to go. I'll find you at the party. Don't worry. Wait, do I need to give him a weapon or something? Uh, how's this supposed to work? Um, can I not just walk right into the party with everything I got on me? I mean... Let me see. I don't know. Bro, let me go over here and check this guy out for a second. Dude. You know you can afford a And there's his head. They just left it here. Wow. That's tough, man. All right, let me see where I need to go. All right, we gotta go to the stables. Iron, solid, and true. I'm hoping I don't gotta strip all the way down, you know, or anything. I mean, I can, like, unequip my, my weapons, you know, if need be. Uh, let's do a quick save. How can I help a brother know? Have you given Malborn the gear you want to smuggle into the embassy? Uh, no, not really. Good. 
I don't know. If I fail this mission, I'll go back and redo it. But the only way you're going to get past the guards is if they really believe you're the right against. Okay. Which means you need to look the part and not be armed to the teeth. Here, put this on. When you're ready, I'll keep the rest of your gear safe until you get back. You'll only have what Melbourne smuggled in for you, plus whatever you can pick up inside. <laughs> you can't go to a party at the Thalmor Embassy dressed like that. Okay. Uh, apparently... Looks like I'm gonna, yeah, have to be stripped down. I guess that will have to do. You should pass for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. Ready to board the carriage to the embassy? Yeah. Uh, Lydia, I don't know. Just good luck. <laughs> for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. Don't worry, it will all be waiting for you when you get back. Just make sure you get back out of there alive with the information we need. Good luck. <laughs> Alright, here we go. I'm gonna start up the next video right where we left off at, and we'll see how the party goes.